no problems. Atlantic Records, I know y'all got NBA Young Boy. Listen, Epic already on my eyes. Rock Nation, listen, please. Atlantic Records, I don't want no problems. I don't want no problems. Y'all niggas already got my fucking YouTube hack down. Got the motherfucking SoundCloud everywhere. You can't even type in Bobby Spurred and my shit pop up. Only hot nigga because Epic owned it. Listen, I don't want no problems with y'all. I'm making my, you know, I'm making over 200,000 a month independent. I do not want no problems because I just came out of prison. I remember making only 5,000 a week, um, 7, 10,000 a week on the block. I'm good. I'm making, please, I don't want no trouble. I want parole. Like, I'm on parole calling and shit. I did not do nothing to two people. I did not do nothing to nobody. I don't want no problems. I'm 28 years old. I'm only 28. I got two years left to my 30s. Please leave me alone. I don't want no problems. I'm slinging big nigga fucking bitch. I was I still do. Wait. Please, I don't want no problems. <laughs> that is so funny. It's okay. My mama told me I was the bad kid, okay? They told me everybody always going against me. It's okay. I ain't used to fighting everybody. Come on, let's fight. Wanna fight? Let's fight. <laughs> I can't take y'all niggas serious, so for real. So what the fuck? Wait, wait, wait. Wait. Y'all niggas cannot be gangsters. It's trying to get niggas locked up at the same time. Let me know what y'all want to be. Y'all want to be gangsters. Y'all want to say fuck Bobby. Or y'all want to call the police on me. Please, let me know. Don't call the police. I'm gonna say fuck me and you come see me to my face and say fuck me. Don't call the police though. Don't be on the Instagrams calling the police, please. Or saying the stuff like police, please, please. I don't want no problems. I understand that. And see, the thing with these labels, these rappers, I don't want no problem with y'all because y'all got y'all labels. And then y'all got the marketing side where some people's gonna try to push to get you locked up where they don't want me to fight back. Then they got the marketers with the bots because Atlantic got the best bots. Atlantic box is crazy. NBA box is about to go crazy. They, they, they bot system and think it's like on um, for a package, like a hundred bots is like, uh, like, no, um, for like a thousand bots is like, some like like a two thousand dollars, some shit like that. They got packages. I don't want no problems with these niggas. Cause they, they, I'm on parole. I'm on parole. In all industry. I do not want no problems. Please, please, y'all, y'all say whatever. Bobby got soft. Just try it or whatever. You know I'm old school, bro. I'm old school, bro. I'm old school gangster, bro. I'm like this shit, bro. I don't like this website thing shit, bro. Please, bro. I'm begging y'all niggas, bro. Please. You got something, you pull up on it, nigga. Please just pull up on me. Don't do this Instagram, please. Or I'll pull up on you. You send me an address. I will come check it, nigga. Please, bro. I promise. I will pay for my last money. I'm motherfucking anything. Just come take a flight anywhere, bro. Please, bro. Just do not do the Instagram shit with me, bro. I'm on parole, bro. I really did this. Y'all niggas don't do this with me, bro. Y'all niggas try to take me back to jail, bro. I know how y'all niggas is, bro. You know what I'm saying? Anything you have to say to me, can you please pull up in my face and say it, bro? I, I don't have no 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 label behind me with hundred bots or none of that. All I got is real shit behind me. So please don't do not do that to me. Well, I'm rich, bro. I'm rich. Like my up my um workers' bills is like forty thousand a month. I don't think people in your family make that. Um, and my family bills is like thirty thousand a month. My clothes is like thirty forty thousand a month. Twenty eight. Um, the, I didn't even go to junior high school. Um, I ran a $4 million last year. Ran a $1 million this year. I, they just don't talk about it because I'm not on your label. I'm not a slave. I'm not winning none of these slaves. So they don't talk about it. You're the biggest slave. Like, NBA is like one of the biggest slaves in the game. He's one of the biggest slaves to them. So they're going to go crazy for boy. You feel me? They're going to make sure all the fake, all the shit y'all see on YouTube is fake views. All the shit is fake. Everything that y'all see. All my dead grandmother. All that shit is fake. It's for a million views. It's $4,000 cash, nigga. On gang, nigga. On my dead grandmother. That's what these labels do. You feel me? They kick that out and they that y'all um going to um fucking they they helped it too because they pay like the radio two thousand every station every p people they pay like two thousand a pop to get they shit playing on things so everything y'all listening to is just all altered altered means fake that this was paid for so y'all minds can listen to this i'm a real nigga so they can't get me with that you feel me i don't listen to bullshit i get money Man, any nigga who's feeding into that like yo i've been locked up for six years i didn't go to junior high school i don't know what the fuck junior high school or high school look like what is y'all excuse that y'all don't have no money I'm about to go do um uh, thing, get some money right now. I'm about to pick up some bands right right now. And if you you'll see me looking nice and clean, you know. I'm just I came I just came to take a shower real quick. I'm gonna be looking nice and clean if you, you know, and pick some more money up. <laughs> yeah, that <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But um 
And as I said, I'm not a slave. I'm not a slave. The rest of these little niggas are slaves and dumb little niggas on drugs and just listen. They overno they late. They overno they contracts. These niggas just out here be talking, bro. Like it's sad, bro. Like y'all niggas really tighten up. And if y'all gonna be always been a young fly nigga i always had i was a spoiled nigga growing up go ask the whole hood i grew up in the hood where you can't even come near nigga go ask the whole hood i was always a spoiled bad ass little nigga i was beating my teachers with boomsticks when i was in second grade nigga running around with prodders and everything that y'all niggas is killing for and bitches suck dick for now nigga that's why i don't give a fuck about shit homie you got talking to you feel me i'm not like no matter how much millions you could put two million behind this three million dollars up behind y'all shit because y'all niggas know when y'all go platinum i don't jack platinum and that shit y'all niggas, none of y'all niggas get residual money show us checks of residual money i can show that checks of residual money every month sitting on my ass nigga that's what independent do i just don't get the label love and all that shit all that fake shit y'all be talking about all that fake blogs and all the shade room and all that dumb shit y'all be posting i don't do that because that shit is fake to the label to promote to get other people minds i'm a smart gangster and i'm rich Y'all niggas, where, what do y'all do? What money you make? Go see last time I did something. I'm always look on my page. I'm doing shows <sighs> by myself. Again, you hear motherfuckers talking in the, the nigga background again. A lot of niggas in the background. I'm not in the background. I'm in with my Draco, my fucking jewelry box, my money. Uh, <laughs> I don't play. I ain't got a Draco. I ain't got no Draco, bro. Do I look like a, do I look like I have a Draco? And that thing ride around with two sticks, nigga. <laughs> Don't look like I ride around with two sticks, nigga. <laughs>
run in front of the clubs when I was 14. Hollywood Butter, though, when I was like 12. Hollywood Butter. Somebody tag Hollywood Butter. At Hollywood Butter. The nigga said security. Tell them what happened when I used to come to the club. They told me I was 18 and over. I couldn't come to the club. Security dragged me out in front of them with their guns. <laughs> and tell them what I mean. Security. <laughs> nigga said security. <laughs>